Hi everyone, this is Teacher Mel. And for today's discussion, an example of non-routine word problems is this one. The sum of two numbers is 21. The difference of the two numbers is 3. What are the numbers? So, ang isang non-routine problems, para masolve yan, kailangan natin mag-draw or uh, any diagram, magsulat tayo ng equation, o di kaya naman listing method, and any other method, okay? Para masolve yung problem. Pwede ding trial and error. Okay? So, for this one, ang unang step, syempre, kailangan natin intindihin yung problem. Ano ba yung sabi ng problem? What are the numbers? So, yung dalawang numbers ang hinahanap natin. Next, syempre, kailangan natin magplano pa din. Ano yung gagawin natin sa problem na to para masolve? Base sa problem, sabi dyan, kapag pinag daw natin yung dalawang numbers, the answer is 21. Let's say, kasi hindi natin alam yung number, gawin natin A, yung isang number, at gawin nating letter B yung pangalawang number. Pag pinag-add daw natin yung dalawang number, the answer is 21. Pero, kapag pinag-subtract daw natin, the answer is 3. Ang gagawin natin is listing method tayo. There are two ways para masolve yung problem na ito. Listing method muna ang ituturo ko sa inyo. Okay, so... We have 1 and 20. Pag pinag-add yan, the answer is 21. 2 and 19. 3 and 18. 4 and 17. 5 and 16. 6 and 15. And we have 7 and 14. 8 and 13. 9 and 12. 10 and 11. 11 and 10. So, ayan yung mga set of numbers na kapag pinag-add natin, the answer is 21. Ngayon, based from these numbers na meron tayo, Tingnan natin, alin dyan, yung kapag pinag-subtract natin, the answer is 3. At ang number na yon ay si 9 and 12. Kasi 12 minus 9, the answer is 3. Numbers are 12 and 9. Next is, we need to check and look back kung tama ba yung sagot natin. Okay, let's check. 12 plus 9, that's 21. Tama. 12 minus 9, 3. Tama. So, therefore, tama yung sagot natin. Okay, nasagutan na natin yung problem na ito. Ang next na gagawin natin is, meron na akong ipapakita sa inyong technique paano i-solve ang problem na to in just a short span of time. Okay. So, ang A plus B daw, ang sagot ay 21. A minus B, the answer is 3. Ang unang step is we need to add the two numbers. So, 21 plus 3 is equal to 24. Tama. Ang sumunod naman na step, i-divide lang natin sa 2 yung 24. Let's divide it. 24 divided by 2, the answer is 12. Ibig sabihin, yung first number natin ay si 12. Next naman, yung 12, isusubtract natin sa ating bigger number which is 21. So, 21 minus 12, the answer is 9. Therefore, the two numbers are 12 and 9. Ang picnic na ito nag apply if we are going to find the numbers given yung sum ng dalawang number and difference ng two numbers. Thank you everyone. Please subscribe for more math videos. Once again, this is Teacher Mel.